Okay, let's start this video with a little campsite visitor. What do you guys think? Is it going to be someone from our dreamy list? And... No freaking way. <laughs> no way! It's my Philbert! Oh my god. <laughs> No way! Oh my god. Okay, I'm a little bit shocked. I honestly did not think this would be anyone good. What is going on? What is going on? You should move here! Yes! Yes! Silbert! Oh no! Come live here! Come live here! No! <laughs> oh my goodness. Is this going to be like really, really, really difficult to make him move in i don't know i have like still some plots to place down oh come on stop talking about s'mores filbert move here no way so i was planning on going on a villager hunt today but apparently this uh campsite villager hunt now no ah uh, filbert come on Okay, I'm gonna go and place down a plot. Here's my dreamy. What is going on in here? Has my campsite luck finally turned around? Wow, this island is blessed with the campsite. So yeah, if you did watch my theme reveal slash dreamy talk, Wilbert is actually one of my dreamy villagers for this island. He is here on the campsite now. That is freaking weird. <laughs> Usually I have like such bad luck with villagers. Um, but yeah, um, I have to say since my memory is kind of bad, I don't remember if in the beginning it is also like really, really difficult to make the campsite visitors move in. Normally, if you do have 10 villagers on your island, whoever is on the campsite will like randomly try to replace one of your existing villagers. But since I don't have 10 villagers, I'm not sure if it's actually that difficult, like, I would kind of think maybe they would just like move in immediately if you have an empty plot. I want to see how this works, but yeah, this might take a little bit of time, so buckle in. And yeah, I'm also thinking like if this is going to take like a forever and a half, we might leave Philbert for a dreamy hunt. Because yeah, sometimes it's kind of annoying to move in the villagers through the campsite. But anyways, we are putting down a tent because today we shall have a new villager on the island. Hey kid, what are you up to? I know, I'm sorry again. <laughs> Oh dear, it's that time again. All my villagers are gonna roast me for not logging in <laughs> for like a week. Okay, so I'm gonna try to chat with Philbert a couple of times here. If he is playing hard to get, we're gonna we're gonna pass on him on the campsite and we're gonna go on a villager hunt later on. Let's see though. I'm gonna try like a few times. Okay, let's see if we win. Please, Philbert. Do not play hard to get. Oh, this one is difficult. Let's go for heart. Oh my goodness. Yes. Is this my lucky day? What is happening? Honestly, guys, I'm like... Whoa, I did not expect that at all. I can move here. I'm Philbert. You're... <laughs> Such a cutie! No way, guys! What on earth? <laughs> what is happening? Welcome to Cinnamon Island, Philbert! He is such a cutie! Okay, well that was so unexpected. I'm still a bit shocked. Like I was I, I was I assumed that the Oh my god, my brain is breaking. I was assuming that the campsite visitor would be just someone trash, like it usually is. I was just like, let's just quickly check who it is and continue our life. But wow! Campsite is lit. We've had like an amazing luck with this campsite on this island. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, let's place down another plot and go for another dreamy hunt. Can we get two dreamies in one day? <laughs> 
Okay, so we have our second plot placed down, ready for a new friend. Okay, well, that was a good start for this day. We are already one dreamy down for this island. That's actually crazy. I'm a bit lost in words. I'm like, what? Did that really happen? Did Philbert just move in through the campsite? Like, what is going on? <laughs> Anyways, you guys, today's, I guess, main quest was supposed to be a little dreamy hunt because, yeah, so far we have just kind of taken all kinds of random villagers that have just happened to pass by. We've also had some interesting autofills and villagers from the campsite and from our kind of organic villager hunt. So yeah, we haven't really done like a proper dreamy hunt. So that's what we're gonna do today, but at least we are off to a good start because we already have one dreamy wow <laughs> what is happening um yeah so i have some nook mile tickets today we are kind of quote unquote cheating for the first time because i did gift myself some um, nook mile tickets from my other account so we have enough tickets for whatever but we also have a lot of lot of dreamies on our villager list so i am thinking that this hunt is probably not gonna take that long if you are curious of who we are hunting for you can watch my whole extended dreamy talk in one of my previous videos but pretty much we're looking for rio murphy or doby Maybe Azelia. Well, Phil Philbert was on the list, but now he isn't anymore. Um, and Eunice. Eunice is like my number one dreamy for this island. So yeah, let's see how the dodo gods are gonna treat us today. Let's see. Okay, I can already see that. Oh, who is this? I uh, can't remember the name. Island number one is... Zoe! Okay. Um, She's... Not the worst ant eater, I have to say. I also think I have her. She's a 2.0 villager, right? I think I have her amiibo card, actually. Yeah, she is cute. She's actually kind of cute. Not that I'm the like the biggest fan of the ant eaters, but Zoe is not bad. She's actually kind of cute. Okay, I might go and drop off my ladder before we continue this hunt because I don't want to be climbing up and down any hills. And yeah, let's see what kind of villagers we run into today. I'm also kind of open to any cute villagers because y'all know me, I'm super indecisive and I might just change my mind halfway through this villager hunt. So yeah, we are kind of like not very strict about our villagers at the moment. Like in case we really like someone we see today, we might as well bring them to the island. We kind of have a very random, random villager lineup at the the moment if you are new here let me quickly show you who is currently living on my island we have pinky savannah kid benjamin chester deirdre and rudy and philbert is going to be joining the ca gang tomorrow okay island number two also i'm really really happy to see the snow I think this is the first time it's snowing like properly also i am having such a hard time like recognizing the villagers because they're wearing the winter gear buzz oh my god what is that buzz okay to be honest buzz is kind of cute in his winter outfit i'm a bit of a sucker for the villagers in their winter gear i'm not gonna lie i think they just look so cozy and cute so how is everyone's christmas preparations coming along what are you guys hoping that you get for Christmas. Do you have any prezies on your wish list? Let me know in the comments. Okay, island number three is a bamboo island. Sometimes we do have good luck on these special islands. Oh no. But yeah, Samsung also not the worst. Even though I'm not a big fan of the mouse villagers. <laughs> So yeah, I'm honestly not expecting today's hunt to go on for very long because we have so many villagers on our dreamy list and usually when you have like more than one option it's a bit always easier obviously to find a villager. So let's see who is going to be the first dreamy to appear. I'm quite excited. I'm also very excited to actually have like villagers that I do want for this island because yeah, we have some interesting villagers. Some of them maybe 
maybe not my favorites, but I can live with them. But yeah, since I do kind of want to bring some cuties to the island, some villagers like Savannah, Pinky, Chester, they're gonna be moving out eventually and be replaced by some of my all time, I don't know, like some of these villagers have been on my one day, I'm gonna invite these villagers to my island list. Why are we just getting mice villagers? Actually, Dora was briefly on my tropical island because of a autofill situation. So she's actually a familiar face. It's good that we're not doing the welcome back challenge thingy. Oh my goodness, I think I have actually had to invite her back once. She, I think she was on our, no way. She's, is she my curse? Is Dora my welcome back villager curse? I think we went, when we did the welcome back a villager hunt challenge, I actually found her and I had to invite her back. But yeah, we never, we, we were never friends. Even when she got her second chance on my tropical island, I just, no, no. <laughs> I don't like the mice. I just don't. In my humble opinion, I think the mice villagers could have looked kind of like the hamster villagers do or something similar. You know, like small and chunky and cute. I think they were really done dirty by the character design. I don't know if you guys agree or what do you think of the mice villagers, but I don't know. I just, I'm not a big fan. Can I, can I go to the side? Thank you. What is up, Chevre? Oh, she's a really cute one. But yeah, if you have been following along my channel for some time, you've probably noticed that I like a lot of villagers. So yeah, for this island, I really want to bring some of these villagers that I've always wanted to invite to my island. But yeah, there just never is enough space. So yeah, for this island, I have chosen a bunch of kind of underrated cuties. And even though I know like Pinky, Savannah, maybe they're not the worst villagers, but yeah, they're just not on my favorites list. I do want to invite some of these cuties to my island. Finally, it's been long overdue. That's what I wanted to say. Oh my God, I'm just getting so distracted today once again. Well, my Christmas preparations are going quite well. I'm always done with everything again. I think I have like two or three gifts that I still need to wrap up. I don't think I really need to buy anything. I'm just really, really looking forward to, I have like four days, no, four. I have almost 10 days off actually for Christmas and I'm so looking forward to that. Cashmere, okay, okay. We are looking for a sheep, but not you. Sorry, <laughs> bye. So yeah, I have nine days off for Christmas. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to like roam around the Christmas markets, drink some Finnish gluggy, which is like kind of like mulled wine, but it doesn't have alcohol in it. And it's just like the coziest thing you can do. Explore all the Christmas markets and be all cozy, sip on your hot gluggy and just have a good time. I'm really looking forward to that. <laughs> and yeah, I really, really love Christmas, but I'm probably going to be quite busy for the next two, three weeks. So content wise, there might be a bit of a break. So. Don't be alarmed if I go missing again. You probably already know me. Sometimes I just go missing for a week or two or three months, you know? <laughs> okay, I'm trying not to do that, but yeah. Just for the holidays, I think I'm gonna be chilling and getting cozy with the family. So yeah, don't be alarmed. Ooh, and we run into our first bull of the day. Is this T-Bone? Agnes? Angus? Okay, Makmu. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. We are not looking for a bull. I'm just happy if T-Bone does not appear on today's hunt. But yeah, it would be so fun to actually find like two dreamies today. Is this our lucky day? But I'm so happy we found Philbert. What on earth? <laughs> that is such good luck. I'm so happy. I love Philbert. My island currently maybe is kind of leaning to this kind of fall, cozy vibes kind of theme. And Philbert maybe isn't the most fall kind of villager, but he has kind of like this astrology vibe house. Ooh, who is in here? Oh, that's Apple. Cute. Okay, moving on. 
So yeah, I think Philbert will fit in quite well. Anyways, like my island is definitely gonna have a bit like an urban vibe. So pretty much any villager can go with that, I think. Also for my little Christmas holiday, I am going to be finally starting my Pokemon Scarlet and Violet adventure. I think I'm gonna be playing Violet, but yeah, can you imagine? We like pre-ordered the game and everything and we haven't had the time to play it. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where I'm standing with that. I don't know if you guys have been playing it. Let me know in the comments if you enjoy it. As per usual, I would have loved to make like some sort of let's play of it, but I think it's already irrelevant at this moment, so. <laughs> Maybe when the next Pokemon launches. Like, I really, really wish my work was not as busy as it is, so I would have more time to create content, but it is what it is, you know? Okay. Who is in here? <gasps> oh, no. Why am I making these weird noises? Guys 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 it's Shino though okay am I honestly gonna be weak and invite her because Loki she's fab <laughs> oh I kind of want to invite her though I mean Honestly, I was kind of like considering her. Yeah, I have a lot of villagers that I'm like, kind of like, I really want to invite this villager one day, but I don't have enough Nintendo Switches to make as many islands as I possibly could to invite like 200 villagers to my island. So yeah, I don't know. Oh, I feel so chaotic today. I feel like I cannot focus. And I'm like, I don't, I, where are all these cuties coming from? They're like distracting me. I'm like, what to do? Philbert, Chino. Guys, I think I want to invite her. I mean, we are on island number nine and we already got Philbert. Is she Peppy or Snooty? Who was my Peppy pick for this island? Oh, I had like Carmen or something, right? Oh, I had a Rio. I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to invite her, guys. She's such a cutie and I know she's like super duper uber super duper too much popular but I'm a kind of sucker for cuties. Sucker for cuties, okay? The only thing better than kicking back and chilling on an island would be to do it forever! Spending time on an island is the best way to find your inner calm and hug it as hard as you can! Oh my god. Um, live on my <laughs> oh my god guys i'm sorry scrap my dreamy list she you know is coming to cinnamon island <laughs> what is going no way okay i mean i mean i feel like she's like the raymond to my cinnamilla island you know like she just appeared from nowhere and she's so cute in her cozy outfit how could i say no to her how how <laughs> Okay, that's kind of crazy, random. Okay, sorry guys. Um, I guess we have to continue to dreamy hunt another day. Oh, she's so cute. Um, yes, welcome to the chaos. Sometimes things happen and we live to dreamy hunt another day. Okay, so I know this was kind of unexpected and slightly chaotic and I feel like I always talk about like doing things and then I end up doing something else. So regardless of me just being a hot mess, we will have two new friends joining our island. They're both cuties. I don't know, maybe I will still invite Rio eventually. Shino is just like, how could I say no to Shino, okay? Um, yeah, chaos, help me. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Anyways, I hope your Christmas preparation preparations are go going well. Why can I not speak? And I don't think I'm gonna be doing a Christmassy episode this year. But if you want to vibe on some cozy toy day vibes with me, I do have my toy day episode from last year. If you do want to come and just like chill and hang out and play some toy day together, play some play and play toy day together. Go through the events of toy day i don't know what i'm saying i'm tired confused i still have the whole house to clean um yeah 
thank you so much for hanging out with me here for a little bit. Maybe our next villager hunt is gonna take a bit longer, hopefully. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to do a really long villager hunt, but next time, I promise, we will hunt for someone from our proper dreamy list, okay? I should not make any promises. Anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this short and sweet villager hunt. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to like it. If you want to join the chaos, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can witness this train wreck every week. Yay! <laughs> And yeah, that is it for me, you guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next week or when I'm back from my holidays. Bye, guys. Wow, honestly, I can't believe Filbert and Shino. Like, what is this? We never have good luck with villagers, do we? At least, like, not, like, easy like this. Anyways, I'll see you next week, guys. Bye.